Hello, hello everyone, it's Nim here today and I'm going to be making this Disney Tsum Tsum trinket or jewelry box, whatever you want to call it, and today we're going to be making Mickey, so let's hop right into it. So to start off, I got this metal container from eBay and it was only for a dollar, but if you don't have this, you can use a plastic container as well. The only thing is that you don't want to bake it in the oven then, uh, but if you want to use like polymer clay, you will need a metal container so that you can put it in the oven. And then I'm going to go ahead and take some black polymer clay and I'm going to roll out a medium thickness kind of sheet of it. Not too thin, not too thick. And by the way, if you're using a plastic container, then you will use air dry clay instead and you will paint on the details. Um, so I'm just letting you guys know that this project can be done without the tin container if you don't have it. Uh, so now I'm just wrapping the lid of it. So I'm only doing the lid right now and I'm just kind of like wrapping it around so that uh, the entire area, the top part is like covered with it. And then I'm just gonna trim off the extra clay that we have on with my blade. So far, this is how your lid should look like. Then I just rolled out some more black polymer clay and this is definitely thicker in the thickness. You want it to be really thick. And I'm gonna take my cutter and I'm gonna cut out two ears for Mickey. And now I'm just going to attach it on. taking a normal dotting tool and I'm just kind of blending it in so that it stays really put. And then I'm going to add some TLS on top so that it's really, really secure because we do not want Mickey to lose an ear here. So I put the lid back on the container and the area that is showing, only that area you're going to cover with red. So you want to close it and see the area. So I rolled out some uh, red polymer clay and it's pretty much the same thickness as we did earlier. And I'm wrapping it around and I'm going to do the exact same thing. I'm just going to like trim off the extra clay. And here you can see that there is some uh, of the silver showing and you want it to show because obviously you want to be able to close the actual container. So yeah, I'm just popping it back on. And now I'm just putting it on my baking pan and I'm placing it downwards as you can see so that the ears uh, don't like come off or anything. And I'm gonna let this bake in the oven for about 15 minutes. Once the thing has completely cooled down, um, this will be really hot, so let it cool down for at least 30 minutes before you move on or like touch it because you don't want to burn yourself. And now I'm just going in with some acrylic paint and I'm just going to draw the Tsum Tsum uh, Mickey face. You can just google pictures, um, it's the easiest way to go about it. So I'm just drawing on the details.
This is literally the third video that I've made related to Disney Tsum Tsums in two weeks. I'm not sure if you guys are enjoying these, but I am really obsessed with Disney Tsum Tsums. I'm thinking of making like uh, the charms, like the little Disney Tsum Tsums in like a charm form. I think that would be super cute. And now I'm just glazing off the entire thing. You will need to do two coats of glaze so that it's really shiny and smooth. And there you go, you have your adorable Mickey Mouse Disney Tsum Tsum container so you can put pretty much whatever you want inside of this. That's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and I'll catch you guys very soon. Bye. Kidding me, this is another car. Why are you giving me so many cars?